Hey, what's going on, everybody? BQ here. Alberto El Patron comments on no showing the Impact Wrestling event and his eventual release. So unless you've been living under a rock, he no showed the main event, Impact Wrestling versus Lucha Underground at WrestleCon, was fired from the company, and they booked a brand new main event for Redemption. So in an interview with Sporting News, so if you guys want to look up the full interview, Sporting News, on why he no-showed the event. Now, the way he speaks is a little different, so uh, <laughs> I'm going to have a hard time reading this, but I'm going to do my absolute best. I'm going to read his two quotes, and then I'm going to give you my personal thoughts on Mr. Elvatron. On why he no-showed the event. Quote, I had a family situation that I needed to attend to. As you know, my family, my kids are my priority. The situation was involving them, and that's why I decided to take care of business and take care of my family situation. And that's all that happened. And that's what, and that, <laughs> and that comes to what I was just saying to you. I know people wanted to know absolutely everything. This only concerns my family, my parents, my sister, myself, and my kids, and that's the way it's going to stay. End quote. On how he's doing after last weekend. Quote, I'm fine. Of course, it's difficult because it's never good to go that way. Our relationship wasn't pretty good or completely good. And this was just something that ended up breaking it. I'm fine, I guess. I'm going to do what I was planning on doing as everybody pl everybody knows I plan on leaving the pro wrestling business in the next year. I've, I have said it several times over and over. And it's because of some of these things where everybody thinks they can get their nose into your business. Is it right to know absolutely everything about you? It's not, end quote. All right, folks. I've got kids. I've got three kids. Many of you have kids. Wrestlers on the roster have kids and have priorities. It's okay to call your family your number one priority because for many of us it is. But it is not okay to back out on a commitment to your employer, your family and family emergencies and things like that is not an excuse to not show up at work because if he really had something like that going on, I'm sure impact wrestling would have worked with him on it, but he didn't show up. Now here's the interesting thing. That video also surfaced with him and Carlito, which was supposed to be during the event and he was drunk. So I don't know what family emergency happened or where he could go out and do that. Now, I don't know if there's confirmation that that was during the event. It's very possible because the event was late at night. You cannot just no show your job, folks. I don't care where the hell you work. If you no show your job, you're probably going to get fired. Communication is key in any relationship. It's, it's key in a romantic relationship. It's key in a business relationship. I'm going to say it again. You cannot just not show up. He takes no responsibility here. And you know, previously when you, when they interview El Patron, you know, Impact Wrestling is a real company, you know, and now all of a sudden it's, oh, well, our relationship wasn't that good. And, and this broke it. Like he, he's taking no responsibility for it. It's like, oh, wait a minute. This is their fault. Weren't you the one that publicly came out and said when you got suspended that the suspension was your idea? He's acting like, like they're in the wrong. This dude has been like this for a long time. And I, I was, I was pulling for him because I was enjoying a lot of the work he was doing. There's some things I didn't like that he was doing. And I was starting to buy into this, uh, main event at the, uh, impact Lucha show. I'm sorry. Well, that as well. I meant to say I was buying into the main event at Redemption. But it's all about communication. And he probably could have saved his job. It, it, it's not, I'm going to say it again, folks. It's not an excuse because you, you love your kids and you have a family and you have these commitments that you just decide that that's so important that you're going to screw everybody else over. That is not the way it works. If you'd like this video, please leave a thumbs up or a thumbs down. I don't give a shit what you do. Um, leave your th your thoughts in the comments. 
about what Alberto El Patron had to say. And again, the guy takes zero responsibility. He, when the inc- incident happened with Paige last year, he got on uh, you know interviews and teleconferences and he made excuses. Didn't take responsibility for anything. You know that's a problem I have with my my uh, middle son. Doesn't take. You know, is never never says I'm sorry. It's always an excuse. But he's also nine years old. This is a grown ass man who I believe is into his forties, and he's never taken the responsibility a single time. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. I'll talk to you soon. Peace.